In this tutorial video, we're going to be seeing what a JPanel object is in Java, and then we're going to be seeing how to use it. So a JPanel object, in essence, is a panel. But more to the point, it's an empty area that can be used either to lay out other components, including other panels, or an area where you can draw graphics on it. So you can think of it as um, a container, if you will. So <clears throat> This is uh, an example of the code to uh, create a panel or JPanel object. So, um, as you can see, <coughs> um, we're working inside the example of our previous video. So, we have our class window, uh, which lets us uh, create a um, or set the parameters for our frame, should I say. Now, in order to be able to create a JPanel object, uh, as you can see, we first have to import the, the javax.swing.jpanel um, package. And we also, in this example, have to import the Java the java.awt.color package because we want to um, fill in the background of our panel just to show you what it represents. So now that that's been done, uh, as I said, we have our code for our frame here. And then underneath, we're instantiating an object type jpanel named pan using the jpanel constructor from uh, the package we imported at the top here. And then <coughs> we're uh, filling in the background uh, of our panel and we're coloring it in blue uh, using um, the package color here at the top. And then uh, we're basically uh, setting um, the content pane for JFrame as uh, as the JPanel. In other words, we're um, letting J letting our frame know that our panel is um, inside it, and in this case, is taking up the entirety of uh, the frame. So this example would give us this. So as you can see, we have our frame. We have our panel that takes up all of the frame, and its background is blue in this case. So we can test this quickly in Eclipse. <coughs> I already typed out the code, so it's the same code. Um, let's try this on application. As you can see, we have our frame, and inside our frame we have our panel, which takes up all of the frame, and its background is blue. So that's what a um, JPanel object is in Java. In the next step, we're going to be seeing how to use this, and we're going to be using um, a precise example. Uh, we're going to be seeing how to um, insert uh, an image into a panel. So for more information on uh, JPanel objects, you can go to um, this link here, so the class JPanel. So you can see all the parameters and methods, and uh, if you're interested, you can look at the uh, official um, lesson on uh, panels on the Oracle website. In this step, we're going to be seeing how to insert an image into our panel. Now, just to recap to make sure you've understood everything we've been doing up until now, um, in our main program, our main method, we are creating a um, frame named win using the window class. Inside the window class, we have the parameters for that frame here. <coughs> and then we have this instruction, which is setting the content pane of JFrame to a uh, panel. And panel is a new class we created in which we'll have the parameters for our panel. So we're letting uh, JFrame know that uh, there's a panel inside it which is uh, in the class panel, named panel here. So in the panel class, uh, this is where we're going to be um, uh, using the method that's going to let us insert the image. Now in order to do that, we need to import these packages. Uh, I'm not going to explain what all of them do. Uh, they're self-explanatory and you should know what most of them do by now. If you don't, you can always look them up on the Oracle website. I will explain, however, what the graphics uh, package does basically imports the graphic class, which is the abstract base class for all graphics contents that allow an application to draw onto components that are realized on various devices, as well as onto off-screen images. So in other words, um, it lets you um, paint components onto your panel using this method here. 
and um, <coughs> using this method here we're also going to use a sub method which is the draw image method which is going to let us insert an image into our panel now uh, basically here we are declaring an object type image here um, which we're going to initialize using the uh, a static method image IO um, which has as a parameter file <clears throat> so this is where you input the uh, name of your file or in our case our image um, which has to be in the folder of your project so if we go quickly to your um, Windows uh, user profile uh, click on workspace here then go to the folder of your project, so in this case my, my first project and your um, image has to be uh, at the base of this folder, so here so let's go back uh, so that's the name of our file and then uh, using the draw image method we're basically uh, drawing the image uh, using these coordinates which are pixels um, and then all of this is inside a try catch block uh, in the case where this file uh, doesn't exist that the program goes uh, right to the end of its execution so <clears throat> let's run the program and as you can see the image is displayed at the coordinates that we declared so obviously this is just one method um, next to uh, many many other methods in the graphics class um, so if you want more information on either the draw image method or on all of the methods from the graphics class, uh, obviously you can go to the Oracle website um, to find out about them. So this is how you use uh, a JPanel object in Java.